But, Dr. Cortex, we have not determined the cause of past failures. <laughs> Moron! This bandicoot will be my general, and he will lead my Cortex commandos to world domination. This time, I shall reign triumphant! We are closer than ever before! Quickly, into the vortex! The Dr. Cortex, the vortex is not ready. We have no idea what it could do. <laughs> Failure again! Capture him! Uh-oh! Prepare the female bandicoot. Done, you crash <laughs> Crystals, of course. But Dr. Cortex, to reach full power, we need not only your master crystal, but also the remaining 25 slave crystals from the surface. How do you expect to retrieve them when we don't have any Earthbound operatives left? You fool! Do you think I'm unaware of the situation? If we don't have any friends left on the surface, then we need to find an enemy. Well, well, well. If it isn't Crash Bandicoot, welcome. I apologize for the crude means used to bring you here, but I rather expect a written invitation would have been turned down. I need your help. Surrounding you are a series of five doors. Through each door lies a well-hidden crystal. The crystals look like this. Bring me the crystals, Crash. That is all I will say for now. We will speak again. No, 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 Crash. I said bring me the crystals! Now, get back in. No, Crash! To save the world, I need crystals. Crystals! One more time. They look like this. Crystals, Crash! Go back through one of those doors and bring me crystals. Look above the doorways. Above each, there is a big crystal-shaped slot. Fill all five crystal slots in this warp room by retrieving one crystal from each of the five areas. Only after we have filled all of the slots in this room can we continue on our quest. This is the last time I will remind you. Well done, Crash! I knew I could rely on you. Now listen carefully. These holograms are hard to maintain. During the course of my intellectual pursuits, I have stumbled across a force that threatens to destroy the world. Crystals are the only means of containing it. The fate of the world is at stake. It is imperative, therefore, that you bring them to me. Three crystals. Not bad. I see you are getting the hang of it. I need to conserve power. I will communicate with you again after you retrieve the fifth crystal. Listen up. 
We are not without enemies. Some of them you may even recognize. Although they cannot harm you inside this warp room, they can attack you on your way to the next one. To get to the next warp room, use the platform that appears in the center of the room. Good luck. <laughs> I see that Ripper Roo failed to prove much of a challenge yet again. But back to business. There are crystals to be gathered. Twenty to be exact. The planets will align shortly, all thirteen of them. And this will create a power great enough to rip the Earth apart. Properly utilized, however, the crystals can absorb and contain the energy. Crash! Is that you? I've been looking everywhere. I don't have much time to tell you this. You have to be careful. Trusting Cortex seems a little unwise. Ten of twenty-five crystals. You're on your way. I'm running low on power, so communication from this point will be difficult. Again, be wary of the pathways between warp rooms. Remember, I'm counting on you. Good show, Crash. The Komodo brothers obviously lacked your medal. But now is not the time to get cocky. There are still many crystals to obtain. Remember, the world is counting on you. Crash, my boy! You are more than halfway there. But I'm sure you've noticed that things are getting harder. The last ten crystals will be the hardest together. And my... <coughs> uh, our enemies will be sending their strongest forces to fortune. I'll contact you again when you have completed the next one. Crash! I have discovered that the opposition is being masterminded by Dr. Nectris Rio, the inventor of the Evolvo Ray. Brio was responsible for our misunderstandings in the past. He forced me to assist him in his plot for world domination, and he's at it again. He will attempt to stand in our way. Be on your guard, Crash. Use the platform to deliver the crystals to Angel. Uh, what is your problem, Bandicoot? I will not ask you again to bring me the crystals. Obtain the remaining five crystals, Crash, and bring them to me. <laughs> yes! My plan is nearly complete, and I have you. Crash Bandicoot, to thank for Engine? What's happening? What's that? Is he stealing our signal? Crash! Cortex isn't going to use the crystals to contain the planet's energy. He's going to harness the force and use it to power the super cortex vortex he has built on his space station. One blast of the ray will cover the entire world, turning everyone into Cortex's mindless slaves. Crash! Don't let him have those crystals! Engine, you fool! She's telling him everything! Ah, yes. We're, uh, we're, we're back now. Pardon the, uh, interruption. Crash. Bring me crystal! last of me, Crash Bandicoot! <laughs> Free 
at last. <laughs> Uka, Uka is free. No, it cannot be. Evil, great evil has come. None have dared to fail to break Uka, Uka, even once. But you, Cortex, you have failed me twice. Great Uka, Uka, it was that infernal. Bandicoot! From deep inside my temple prison, I sent you simple instructions to follow. But you lost the gems, you lost the crystals, and I have lost my patience! There is now no other power source left on this planet. I know, we've had a few unfortunate setbacks. And failed! But since your bumbling has managed to set me free, I am feeling generous. There is still a way for us to amass the power needed to enslave this miserable planet. And this time, this time the great Uka Uka will make sure that you do it right! Crash, crash, crash. Why must you always muck in my mud? Oh look, I have a mask helping me too. We will find out which one is more powerful soon enough. Why, why must you continue to be a thorn in our side? What? Where was I? Oh, Tiny was a good fellow. He hated everyone and everything, but a good heart nonetheless. Please be more reasonable with my minions next time. Well, you've crashed a few parties before, but I never expected you to make it this far. If you don't turn back, I will inflict a thousand years of suffering on you and the entire universe! You insolent, insignificant morons! By defeating entropy, you have placed us all in grave risk! <laughs> Crash, Coco, you must realize that this time twister machine is very delicate. Without Dr. Entropy's constant care and control, who knows what it will do? It's funny how history repeats itself. Yet again, Engine has failed to defeat you. For this, we must destroy you! <laughs> oh, my aching head. I'm not feeling myself these days. So, the end is in sight. Gather another five crystals, and again you will have foiled my plan. Or will you? <laughs> I'm sorry. This is the part where I'm supposed to be angry, full of rage, incensed beyond belief. Once again, you have outsmarted and outspun my best henchmen. I should be rather upset, shouldn't I? And in fact, we're furious! But it seems you have overlooked one small detail, you little orange delivery boy! Now that you have gathered all the crystals, all we have to do is take them from you! Bandicoot for the last time! Give the crystals to me!
defeated again. This is not fair. Maybe I should retire to a nice big beach with a nice big drink and a woman with nice big bags of ice for my head. It's not over, Bandicoot. There are still the gems. We still have a chance to triumph. <laughs>